hey guys, how you doing? Welcome back. I was just drinking from my new Thermos Smart Lid that I unpacked and showed you in another video, which I can link to you down below. And today I'm just gonna do a review follow-up on my thoughts and how I like it and how it works and uh, give you a, a little update. So I purchased this uh, about mm, one and a half weeks ago. So I've been using it for a couple of weeks. And I actually really like it because it helps me keep track of how much I'm drinking and I wasn't drinking enough water before and I need to drink more water because it's just healthy and helps you lose weight and it also will help with the cellulite reduction, your skin, your hair, everything. Um, it's just a, a benefit of water. So here is the Smart Lid Thermos I purchased and you can see this blue part here is the actual um, water holder and this is dishwasher safe. And then if you take a look at this, this is the lid um, which has the um, mechanics in it here um, for the Bluetooth and charging. So you really wanna be careful and hand wash this very carefully um, so that you don't get anything wet that will affect um, the Bluetooth and the mechanics of the smart lid. So I just wanted to give you an update on that. And I'm going to show you the app on my phone that I use to keep track of the um, water that I'm taking. And it's really very um, easy to use. It also connects to my Fitbit. And if you can see, I just opened the app here and it shows you here that the temperature of the water is at 61 degrees. I actually keep the water in, um, I keep the water in the refrigerator and then I pour it into my, my thermos. So I have a little bit colder, especially when I'm exercising, I like cold water. Most of the time I'll drink uh, room temperature, but it doesn't matter, it's, it's personal preference. So it also shows you um, how many ounces, six ounces within the last 1.3 hours. And, um, whoops, there we go. And I took two sips. So it's down to the sips. It's really quite genius. And I have mine set to 72 ounces a day, um, but you can change it to whatever you want. I wanted to start with 72 ounces, which I've been kind of close to meeting on one day, a couple days I met it um, exactly, and I can show you that as well. So today I'm at 74% um, of my goal of 72 ounces. And it even breaks down by the hour, how much you drank. Um, you have your week's activity here and your monthly activity. So I can see how much I drank each week. And uh, you can see here I've hit three, three days out of the week I hit my goal. Okay, and then you can also go to the settings button. Here we are. So um, you can this is where you calibrate and you can customize the color of that blue button. I have mine blue, but you can customize the color. And here you can also, you know, you can put the device to sleep so that you're not having to charge it as much. I have not charged it one single time um, since I started using it. And you can ch see that the battery is only halfway drained. So that's really good. It's hold holding its battery for a long time. Um, you can set up reminders. Um, you have your profile, I put my picture on there, and um, uh, that's kind of cool. So I also wanted to show you where you can set the mount that you're drinking. I need my glasses. Here we go. So if you go to profile, this is where I have my picture. Um, I have this set to 72 ounces a day, but I wanted to show you here under the ounces per day. They have the custom goal, which is what I have mine set on at 72 ounces. And you can just slide this back and forth and you can see that it's, it's moving. Or you can go to suggested goal, put in your age, your sex, your height, your weight, your activity duration a day, and your activity intensity. And it tells you your suggested water intake. Um, it says 112 ounces. I don't think I'm quite ready for that. I do want to get there, um, but 
I haven't been able to hit the 72 yet, but you know, it's just kind of a conscious reminder of constantly to be drinking water, which I haven't been doing. I mean, this morning I was really bad. I didn't drink a lot of water this morning. So now I'm playing catch up towards the end of the day. Um, but you can actually add reminders in here to, it'll actually remind you, hey, you know, you need to drink some water. You haven't had any water in the last, you know, hour or so. So I might have to do that as well. But all in all, I really liked this, um, this water bottle. It's been great for me. And it's uh, got an easy app that you can use. Um, it also works with my Fitbit. So I'm gonna show you that real quick. Uh, my Fitbit app, the same thing. It shows 47 fluid ounces of 109. Well, I had mine set originally to 102 ounces, so it's not synced yet. But um, it, it tells you how many ounces and again, by day, <clears throat> how many ounces you drank. So that too is good. I haven't been using the Fitbit one as much as I'm using the actual Thermos app, which I think is uh, very helpful to me. So um, one thing I wanted to show you is under the goal, under the uh, reminders, which I think I'm gonna set up my reminders. I actually already put that on there. So um, if you want to set up reminders to remind you to drink water and how much um, at a certain time, you, you're gonna just click on this goal progress and it automatically um, keeps you on track throughout the day. So you can create a my, reminder by adding the, hitting the plus sign, but I already created this reminder. Um, you, know, you can tell you know, Linda, hey, drink eight ounces in the next hour. So if I'm trying to drink 72 ounces of water, I need to drink at least eight ounces of water um, every hour for the next nine hours. So that'll hit my goal, but you know, sometimes you forget and you haven't drank anything in eight, in eight hours. And the thermos holds 24 ounces. So if that gives you an idea, you could drink two, two of those in, an, in a couple of hours. So um, let me just get back to here at the beginning. So let me just give you my thoughts on, on how I feel about this um, smart lid thermos. I'm actually uh, really liking it. My goal was to drink more water. That's the reason I got it. And so that I can take it everywhere I go and it's always tracking how much water I'm drinking. I can fill it up at the gym. I can fill it up, you know, if I'm walking on the trail, um, you know, I can put water in it that's cold or, you know, whenever from home. So it's really helpful. The app that comes with the Smart Lid uh, Thermos is very easy to use. It's down to the, you know, the hour, the minute, how many sips, which I just think is, it's kind of funny actually. And it's, it's fun to use just to check, you know, and I'm find myself checking it all the time. I'm like, okay, how much water have I drank? And, you know, I look and see how much I've drank and then I know if I need to, to drink more throughout the day. Um, I do find myself obviously going to the bathroom more. It's um, the more intake I, I have of water, the more I'm going to the bathroom, which is a good thing um, because that means it's working. And, you know, I do want to get to the goal of um, the intended, the, the actual goal that's set in the app, the 112 and see how that works. But I know that drinking more water is very, um, is, is a huge health benefit and it will help in my goals of losing weight, reducing the cellulite, help with my skin, um, you know, overall just very good for your body. So I would definitely recommend um, if you're interested in, in you know, losing weight, reducing your cellulite, keeping your, yourself healthy, your skin clear, then to, um, and to drink more water, then I would definitely recommend the Thermos Smart Lid. It's um, been great for me and I'm really happy with the purchase. If you're interested in um, where I purchased it, I'm going to add the link below so that you can get it too. I am not a spokesperson for Thermos Smart Lid. I just researched and bought this on my own. Um, unfortunately, there's no discount. I, I will put in the link of where I purchased it. It only cost me $20 and maybe that will still be available um, or you can get something on Amazon. There are other uh, sources where you can get this smart lid. 
So thanks for listening. Thanks for watching and keep to your goals and see you next time.